How's it going, everyone? Today, I'm going to be showing you how to transfer uh, your three models from Blender uh, with texture over to Godot 4.3 game engine. So here's an example that I did earlier. This is a, a bench that I made. And then if we go over to Godot, here's that same bench with all the textures and everything. Uh, so the problem I've been having uh, recently is that these textures uh, were not loading in when I was importing my object. So here uh, is another 3D model I made, it's just some grass. Uh, and in Blender, as you can see, the textures are there. Uh, however, when I import it over to Ghetto, uh, they're missing. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how to transfer them over to include those textures. Uh, so here we go on our 3D model. First thing you want to do is go to UV editing. We want to select all by pressing A and then over to our image, we're going to press A again and then press U and we're going to do smart UV project. Unwrap and there's our image unwrapped and then we're going to go to shading. From here in our node editor, we're going to control A and add an image texture. Click new, and you can name this whatever you want. You can name it grass. Actually, I'll get name it grass text. New image, and then we're gonna go over to the render properties and change some settings. Change this to cycles, uh, this to 200, and then over to bake. We're gonna make this diffuse and we're going to uncheck these because we're only one in color and then we're going to bake oh no, no make sure you select your object try it again this may take a couple seconds i got this method uh from a youtube tutorial uh which was which i'll include the link in the description but it was that video specifically it was more for unity and i'll show you the changes that i made uh, for Godot importing in Godot. So there we got our image baked and we want to copy and paste this over and then connect these color dots and then we're going to delete this. So all we're left with are these three nodes. Let's see. Now after this we're going to save. We want to make sure to save our image and you want to save it into uh, your Godot like game project folder, save image as, and then do the same uh, with your three models. So go to export, and then we want to, for Godot specifically, you want to export it as an object. Uh, this way it'll keep all your textures. I've noticed with other formats, it's sometimes it's blocky, and a lot of them, or all of them, don't even uh, export the texture. So we got to export in Godot, it loads in, and then we're going to bring out our grass, and there we go. It's all green. Uh, so that's basically it, and that's how you transfer your 3D models over to Godot with your textures included.